Hello and welcome to lesson 10.2. We still talk about plugins in QGIS and one plugin we have used in the last lessons already was also named Quick OSM. So if you're not aware of that pl plugin, the Quick OSM allows you to extract data from OpenStreetMap. So let's have a look here. Quick OSM. It's, of course, it is already installed here. It's from Etienne Trimel. And um, so what it does, we are using here now the OpenStreetMap monochrome data set or WMS. So it's a web mapping service. We can just see the map, but we cannot interact nor style this map. But we can see the items that are stored in OpenStreetMap. And uh, QuickOSM makes it possible or enables us to download this data. So let's have a look here on Amenity. And let's find out whether there are some ATMs here in the Harz Mountain regions. We can select whether we are looking in a village or town. So you can define a certain area around a village or town with a certain buffer. We can also say we would like to use a canvas extent. So what we can see now on the map, a layer extent or not spatial at all. But we will now take the canvas extent and run the query. But first, before running the query, let's have a look here on the advanced. So we are searching nodes, ways, and relations for these key values. And we would like to see the results, whether they are points, lines, multi-line strings, or multi-polygons. So in our case, amenities and ATM, I don't suspect that these will be shipped as multi-line strings and multi-polygons, neither as lines. So I'm removing these outputs. Otherwise, I will get, um, I will get layers for everything that was found even if it's just an outlier or some some malformed um, point because someone took the advanced <laughs> took the idea to 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 digitize an atm as uh, as a line or as a way consisting of different nodes if you're doing big queries try to change the timeout value to increase this value then you can de define the directory where to save it and file prefix we will just run the query for the moment and now we can see all the atms that are around the hearts mountain regions right and it's called amenity atm already it's a memory layer so please do not forget to store it locally um by saying so we have worked with this um, now direct, but there is a way to create a query itself. So by querying, let's have a look here on the overpass turbo. This is somehow a query for Berliner Straßenbrunn. So water pumps in Berlin. Let's run it. taking some time to query the interpreter. Because there are a lot of ways and nodes combined with each other, also with relations. So it could take some time. In the meantime, let's discuss the question of what is a key in the value. So you will find wiki.openstreetmap.org wiki, wiki slash map features where you can or where you see, okay, this is the Carter rendering. So this is a symbol that is used in the OpenStreetMap map itself. And um, the combination that is underlying is well, uh, is listed here as key and value. So when we set amenity ATM, right? Let's have a look. ATM. There's the amenity ATM. It is defined as a node and or it should be a uh, Treat it as a node, and there's some sort of definition of what this amenity is all about. Now, the our our test set here has already worked out, so we are now aware where all the water pumps in Berlin are, and you can select here the different items. Let's go back to the to the plugin itself, and we will now create a new custom query to get all the ice cream shops around the hearts regions right so what we are doing we will output it as a json and we are querying the area the area should be of region type mountain area and the name should be hearts you can also write en 
but then you need to make sure that the English translation is hearts. So uh, we will stick with the key name and value hearts, and we will use the same to query this. Uh, we will use this this region for querying of the nodes in the area query. So area query is up here, and we will try ask ourselves where are the amenities with the value ice cream. So we will run once again. You can check the advanced parameters, but we will stick to it with the moment. We will run the query. Now we don't have a, a, a flashy name for it, so rename the layer. This is uh, amenity ice cream. Now the main advantage uh, compared to this first approach, where we just said, well, I would like to have all the all the ATMs in the, in the region, is that I already know that they are inside this crooked polygon without even digitizing or getting an idea about the shape of the Hearts Mountain region. So that makes it even easier to download OSM data to your local local file share. And um, what I would also like to take into uh, or point out is that there you can also import an OSM file using Quick OSM. So if you have a PBF export, maybe from the GeoFabric or somewhere else, you can uh, um, import it from an OSM file here as well. And I really love this plugin. It's just epic. Um, so please give a big shout out to the team from 3Liz. Um, visit their website. Um, you can also sponsor the plugin as you can do with most of all the other plugins as well. So if they are if they are on Q, on on GitHub, make sure to give some love. And um, I hope you liked it. If you have any questions or comments you would like to make, make it down at the bottom. Otherwise, subscribe. Take care and goodbye.